Some fascinations are short-lived, while a true passion can span years. Zaida Omar began her love affair with fashion when she was still choosing her clothes in the kiddies department. And now she's amassed a dedicated audience of followers in the blogosphere. Michelle visited Zaida in Durban and picked up some summer style tips. Meet Zaida Omar, a 20-something who's driven by a passion for food, fashion and red lipstick. At least that's how she describes herself. It's a sassy description, but it also hints at a confident and perceptive individual. Somebody who knows all about style is fashion blogger Zaida Umar, who will be giving us the inside scoop on this summer's latest trends. Even as a little girl, Zaida loved playing at being a fashion designer. But when the time came to choose a career, Couture initially took second place to cuisine. Zaida. Hello, lovely to meet you. Lovely to meet you too. Initially, you wanted to be something else before you became this extraordinary fashion stylist. I actually am a qualified chef. I started off with a great love of food, but eventually I realized it wasn't something I was willing to put in endless hours for. I preferred fashion, so that's why I made the move into fashion. What inspired you to start a blog? I needed a creative outlet, so I read a few blogs and it wasn't so big in South Africa at the time, and I thought, you know what, I can do this. This looks so cool, I love styling. Let me try it out, and that's how I started. Zaida, what type of content would we find on your blog? I write about my experiences in life. I put up my outfits that I've styled. I do beauty reviews, product reviews, anything to inspire people. Well, you've been a little modest. You model as well. What is that experience like? It's actually quite fun. I never knew that. I've always wanted or admired models. I wanted to be a model when I was little. And then I thought, you know what, let me model for my blog so I can control what I wear and how I wear it. You know, I can control everything, so. Being in control also means taking responsibility for the outcome. Zaida is never satisfied with anything less than her best. How would you best describe the look you're wearing? A mixture of everything, the latest trends. I've got nude shoes, which is very hot. I've got white and orange, which are the two hottest colors for the season. And then I've got the tribal trend. And where would you typically wear this outfit to? I would wear this to brunch with my friends, maybe a cocktail party. I could grab my luggage and get on a flight. Also, I thought, because I'm not wearing any jewellery, I thought I'd accessorise with this. Maybe I could add this and go for dinner. So it's a little subtle accessory and it just... Yeah, and it jazzes up your outfit, yes. Zaida had offered to share some pointers for summer style and hairstylist and makeup artist Neil Ramatha was applying the finishing touches. Alright, I know that Arya is standing by. What have you gone with her look? 70s meets boho chic. It's soft and flowy. It's a beautiful hue of blue and it's flowing, perfect for summer. We'll start off with the belt. It's a plain rope belt, which I think would cinch in her waist and give her a bit more shape. So the belt, as you said, gives a bit of shape. What's next? The 70s fringe is so hot right now, so I thought we could accessorize with this. I'm loving it, it's very playful and fun. I think it also suits the dress because they're both so flowy and then she has some shape on her waist. What final accessory are you adding? I've got a lovely bracelet. Oh, what a beautiful vintage piece. Where did you get that? Thank you, I actually got this on one of my travels to Istanbul and I thought I'd use the blue to tie in with the dress. The outfit comes beautifully together, accessories works so well and the colors, perfect. Well, you've got a different look for us. What can we expect? I've got something a little sparkly. I'm looking forward to the evening wear. Thank you. The makeup process began from scratch, and what at first seemed like war paint became the foundation of an exquisitely sculpted face. Look how lovely you ladies look. I'm loving it, it's a complete change. Thank you. So where would you wear this outfit to? A night out, anywhere, wherever you'd like to go. Gorgeous in black. Now Zaida, I see you've kept your white jeans, but you've added things. Tell me about that. The reason I kept my white jeans is to show you the versatility of a staple item. You can dress it up, dress it down, and when, it, when you're in a hurry, you don't have to change your whole outfit. Just change your shoes or your top. I've changed both, and you have a whole new outfit. Aria, and you off to dinner, all dressed up. Thank you so much. Zaida, look into the future, the next five years. Where do you see yourself? I want to start a fashion line. Just curate the, the pieces that I love and let everyone else enjoy it. And with Zaida's eye for elegance, combined with a subtle sense of fun, her ambition seems eminently attainable. 